What is up my guys and girls of YouTube, it is your boy Justin Moe here And today I want to talk to you guys and girls about, hopefully if I could get this mic straight, there we go I want to talk to you guys and girls about how to make yourself make a beat easier From, I don't know, I guess you could say transplanting a, a beat in your head into the music program How to get a beat from your head into the music program I think that sounds a little bit more like it for the main part, I'll be talking about the percussion side, aka the kick, the snare, whatever you got in your head, in your mind at the time. Maybe I'll be able to go over in a melody as well, or maybe I could do that in another video. So maybe I'll do it in a two-part video. That way I can make it like the first beat with the beat, like boom, boom, and then the next one I'll do using chords or melody that I have in my mind. All right, so let's say I got a beat in my head. I don't know. Boom, boom. You know, something you could think of in your head. All right, first step would be to change the BPM of the project. This is always a must when it comes to making any type of beat in your project. You have to have the right tempo. So for here, I'm going to right click 140. I'm going to go to tap. And then I'm going to tap on, I guess, uh, my mouse here. Boom. All right, so I'm getting around 74, 75. Um, I'll hit metronome and I'll hit play. Boom. Boom, boom, boom. All right, cool. And I guess for reference, just in case, I'm going to go into Edison and I'm going to hit record on play for what you call it on on play. And then when I hit play over here, it'll do it. I'm going to give myself a little bit of a memory just in case I forget it. I don't know. One, two, three, and. Hold on. All right, whatever. I'm going to keep this third one here. So this third one, I'm going to just double click it. Come on, fucking do what? Hold on, stop. There we go. All right, something like that. Um, Cool. So just in case I forget the melody. Easy stuff you got to do, just lay it down. All you got to do is start with the kicks. Matter of fact, you can even beatbox it if you want. I'm going to do that soon. So I'm going to go into, I don't know, downloads, find a little kick or something. Kigs. Mm, got a little hat in it. Okay. I'm keeping that. So the starting, the kick is going to go boom, boom, ch boom. Ch so to play with the melody. So it's like this. Boom. Boom, and I guess third kick is there. So good, we have our kicks laid down. The next easiest thing to do would be the snares. So let's see, is there a snare here? Uh, claps and snares, I guess. I'm gonna layer it with the clap and oop, with the clap and and this little snap here. Claps, snares usually go on the second and fourth beat of a measure. Usually that's the key thing. Of course, you can always add in flavors or whatnot. So, yeah. So, we're going to need hats after that. Okay. Finally found a hat. So, let's play back this. So, all those little... That's probably the hats that I had in my mind. <laughs> Put that for starter. And of course, because our tempo's slow, we're going to have to go into it. I'm doing that just so we can have a full like headset of what we got here in this beat. And then I'm gonna add in the flavors or the accents, you know. So, boom, boom. all right, so something along this line. All right, so cool. That sounds pretty neat for me now, for right now. So the ch is probably a snare, uh, not a snare, a little symbol in my head or something.
this. Mm, it works there too. Maybe I can add in another one here. It works out. So that's basically you getting your mindset of making the beat from your head. Boom, boom. Alright. And that's mainly the beat part, like I said, the drums part. You can always add in extra flavor, whatever comes in your mind, because, you know, beatboxing, you can't put all the sounds, you know, down. Okay, this one. Something like that. Or maybe three. Just like that. Pro tip, if you want, you could like, you know, automate the volume, the velocity of the hi-hats, make it a little bit natural. -er. Alright, um. Boom, boom. So there we go. That's basically what I had envisioned in my head here. If I hit play. So yeah, that's basically it. You could just, you know, throw it into a uh, playlist, do some unique stuff by, you know, copying the pattern, whatever, clone, and then changing it up. But this is basically how you get your mind into the music. So real, re real, blah, 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 blah. So real quick recap. First, set the tempo. Set the metronome on so you can have it. Then layer using the simple stuff like the kick and then the snares and use the fillers for hats, of course. And then add whatever else sounds, you know, pretty damn good to you. So, yes, thank you guys and girls for watching. Thumbs up the video if you enjoyed it. Subscribe to your boy Justin Omoe if you want to see more. And, yeah, let me know what else you want to see in the, you know, videos to come. Let me know in the comment section below. And yeah, my name is Justin Omoe. And with that being said, peace. I'm out. See you later.